Evergreen trees are always a good option, right? Right, especially right here in North Texas, and that's because of their year-round foliage. There are actually several pine trees that do very well in the North Texas climate, and Jeff Ray's got some recommendations in today's Gardening 101. Adapted plants from North Texas can come from anywhere, even a harsh environment on the other side of the world. What kind of pine is this? This is an Afghan pine. This is an Afghan pine. Afghan pine. Very well suited to our area. The Afghan pine is well suited for North Texas and grows over 50 feet tall with long, soft needles and dramatic bark. It is disease and drought resistant. It's green year round, and that's the nice thing about conifers. This makes a good barrier between your house and another or to block a view of a street or can also buffer sound. The Japanese black pine is a signature tree in any oriental garden. It just has that look. As this matures, it assumes a very asymmetrical shape, which lends itself very well to uh, you know, the aesthetics of a Japanese garden. You can train the tree to produce this miniature look if you like. It can get over 30 feet tall if you just let it grow. If you like songbirds or need a tall green fence, consider the eastern red cedar. There are male and female versions. When cedar wax queens come through in the winter, they will devour the blueberries on the female uh, eastern red cedar. These junipers are extremely tough and low maintenance. Songbirds like to nest in the thick foliage. The native loblolly pine is fast growing and more attractive when planted in groups. It is extremely hardy. Water them uh, regularly the first two years until they're established, and after that, they should be able to survive on annual rainfall. Four great evergreens to help fill different needs for your yard, all proven winners in our tough climate. Jeff Ray, Gardening 101. And if you've got a question about your garden, just go to our website, cbsdfw.com, and click on the Gardening 101 link. Submit it, and Jeff will try to find you an answer.